My name is Vaid Faramendian from Iran, based on Tehran. Uh, it's around 4 a.m. here in Iran. And I'm here to talk about connecting to uh, Elasticsearch using the uh, Microsoft Power BI uh, platform. Uh, currently, I'm working as the chief technology officer in Iranian Ospian company, and we're working on uh, largest maritime ERP system in Iran. Uh, in this session, I'm going to talk about what's Power BI, uh, why we need Power BI, and how we can connect uh, to Elasticsearch in Power BI. And finally, we have a quick sum up of our uh, notes. Uh, so let's just start with uh, what's Power BI. Uh, in fact, it's uh, an interactive data visualization software developed by Microsoft with primary focus on business intelligence infrastructures. Uh, it's for sure is part of the Microsoft Power Platform with uh, various tools available for it. The Power BI Desktop for uh, creating the uh, dashboards, Power BI Web for uh, surfing the web and uh, uh, viewing the contents in the web uh, as a web uh, contents. And also it uh, has the uh, Power BI report for generating the reports and the final the Power BI mobile for uh, displaying the uh, generated dashboards in the uh, mobile applications and mobile devices. Uh, why we need Power BI? Uh, it should be uh, really important to point it out that for most IT professionals, the uh, Elastic Stack uh, Combination is familiar nowadays. Elasticsearch, the heart of the stack, plays the role of a search analytic database, while the log stack serves the server-side data processing pipeline to ingest data. The Cuban is used to visualize all this data, but uh, the world uh, is not always about the elastic stack. Uh, with the importance of data increasing rapidly in all businesses, many companies have implemented their own business intelligence infrastructures to suit their needs, uh, to make sure their data analytics. Uh, one of the well-known uh, products in BI is Microsoft Power BI. Uh, so in this session, uh, as I mentioned before, I'm going to uh, talk about this and I will show how the data stored in Elasticsearch can be visualized using Power instead of Kibana. Uh, one of the benefits of this uh, is that if uh, you are using Power BI as, you are, as your BI infrastructure, uh, you can easily inter integrate this infrastructure with elastic data sources and visualize your entire organization's data in the form of a centralized dashboard, which is really important for organizations to have a centralized management points in order to reduce their risks and to minimize their technology stacks to have a better uh, performance of their management tools. Overall, the, the uh, main benefits of uh, using the uh, Power BI is its uh, integration. Uh, of course, it integrates seamlessly with existing applications. It supports many and many uh, the, uh, data source uh, from the SQL Server, Oracle, uh, MySQL, uh, various ODBC connections, or I don't know, the Hadoop uh, databases, uh, all are uh, can be connected to the, to the Power BI and all can be combined together to provide a very uh, useful dashboards for the uh, organization administrators or the staffs or the end users. Uh, Power BI has a rich personalized dashboards. You can easily uh, personalize your visuals. You can create your own, I don't know, bars, or you can have your uh, drill down bars to uh, get uh, to uh, provide the detailed uh, data view for your users. It has also a great balance between the simplicity and the performance. While it is a really great and really simple applications to uh, produce dashboards, it has a significant and a great performance and it provides really great performance for the users. Uh, supports the advanced data services. As I told you, you can connect using the ODBC, you can connect to the ODBC uh, the 
you can connect to various data sources using the ODBC connections, or even you can call uh, various uh, web APIs in order to gather your data. You can read your data from text files, from Excel, uh, but from JSON files, and etc. It has no specialized technical support required because it's really simple. However, if you uh, need uh, the uh, technical support, uh, there is many and many resources available uh, on the internet and you can uh, easily find you the answer of your questions. The use cases where the Power BI can uh, play a really good uh, role. Uh, one of them is the user behavior analysis and user modeling, where we are going to uh, find out the, the user behavior during our, our applications or uh, in e-commerce ecosystem intelligence in order to uh, track the financial related issues or to better inventor optimizations uh, to find the better sales of point in our, uh, I don't know, fiscal year or other parts, or it uh, could be really beneficial to any claims, the billing and the collection reports or resource management systems. Uh, so after this introduction about the Power BI, let's see how we can connect with Elasticsearch. In order to connect with Elasticsearch, uh, we need to install the uh, elastic ODBC driver. After the elastic ODBC drivers installed, we can, and after we uh, configured it properly using Power BI uh, dash, uh, desktop, using Power BI desktop, we can uh, choose the ODBC connection to connect to the elastic uh, search data source. Unfortunately, there is no direct uh, connection between Power BI and elastic search, and we need to use the ODBC connections in order to uh fulfill these requirements uh after selecting the odbc connections and after that the uh connection uh done and once the connected power we will read elastic search catalogs as you can see in this image you can uh, select the desired uh, table and uh, click on the load button to load your data from elastic search to the power bi uh, uh, local databases uh, after that, uh, the data is loaded to the Power BI, you can uh, start analyzing your data. However, Power BI also supports the direct query mode too, uh, but uh, it might have some side effects to your, on your overall performance of your uh, operational systems. So you should uh, take into account the trade of uh, choosing the direct query mode or the loading mode. Uh, and about the final notes, if you are, if you find this uh, session interesting, so you can read more about Microsoft Power BI uh, by referring to the uh, powerbi.microsoft.com. Of course, if you want to know more about Elasticsearch, you can go to Elasticco slash guide and you can download the Elastic ODBC driver uh, by referring to Elasticco slash downloads slash ODBC client. Uh, in order to connect me to further this discussion and to uh, further over uh, speech, you can find me on GitHub using my White Farmandian handle, or you can follow me on Instagram, my LinkedIn, Twitter using the underscore Jingat account, or my, you can follow our Medium uh, notes using the HTTPS Jingat at Medium.com. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this uh, lightning talk. If there's any uh, question, I'm here to answer you. Very glad to meet you all. And also, I, I would like to thank all the uh, organizing teams for their support and covering this uh, community conference. Thank you very much.